All right, hello, yeah, Curtis here. I'm gonna do a little do-it-yourself. I'm gonna try and change the uh, tub drain. And uh, as you can see, the, the center is all corroded out, so there's nothing left to grab a hold of with a um, you know, pair of um, vice grips or a wrench or anything. Um, I'm too cheap to go and buy a drain key for 30 bucks at the uh, hardware store, so I'm gonna try something else. Uh, initially, I tried using a pair of channel locks and pulling out, trying to get some grip on it and turning it, but it just wants to slide. There's nothing, nothing going on with that. And then I tried a pair of channel locks with the rubber grip, see if that would maybe grab a hold of it a little. Put that in the middle of it to put a pressure on it, and then try and turn it, and still the same thing. So what I'm gonna try and do is is take a hacksaw blade. Um, you might just have to take the blade itself because I don't think your hacksaw is going to fit in there and just make a little cut right here and then uh, use a screwdriver and try and tap it to see if we can get it started so I'm going to go ahead and attempt this see what happens too far you want to get into you don't want to go through it Take a, see if I can get this little chunk out. That'll definitely give me a good little bite. should allow my screwdriver to get down in there and give me a decent bite. So we'll take our screwdriver, put it right in that notch. You can see it. So you can see I just one big bite and one right next to it. So that screwdriver will give you a good angle and maybe we can get it to turn. starting to work. Probably should have took all the soaps and stuff out of here before I start banging. Do another one on this side. That way it's a little easier to work.
we go. Recess, so it's hard to get a pair of channel locks down in there. It looks like they did use plumber's putty, so that was good instead of using a gasket. So you can see the center was no good at all. They did use plumber's putty. So we'll clean this up and get the new one. Um, the new ones come with a gasket, but I'd throw that away. Goodbye. I think I paid $2 for some plumber's putty, but it comes with this gasket. So this is what your new one's going to look like. And this Toss that out of here, it's no good. You're just asking for problems. So what you're gonna do is uh, unscrew that and that's what the center should look like. You can take a wrench and put it in there and uh, turn it back in. So we'll get this cleaned up and get the new one put in there. All right, so we'll clean this up and get the new one put back in here. I've got a gasket up underneath there, so it's all sealed up. See if they go. Now take your plumber's putty. So this is just uh Harvey's Plumber's Putty just got a local Royal King or hardware store. And work it in your hands, knead it around for a little while. Get a little more limber. I 
and you want to make it look like a snake or whatever and take it put it around your put it around your um, new drain make it the size and you want excess and it'll all squeeze out as you put it in but that will assure of a good seal all right Then uh, just start squeezing it in there. And what I did is I grabbed a 5 8 wrench that fits perfectly around that stem in there. Then you can take a screwdriver and spin it in there nice and easy. I make a certain tool for this, but again, I'm cheap and I don't want to spend ten dollars on another tool that I really don't have any multiple purposes for. So you can see that it's all squeezing out of there as it's tightening down. Now I'm no plumber by any means. I'm not sure exactly how tight this needs to be. And knowing me, I'll make it too tight. But a good hand tight, I think, will do. I gotta remember that I may have to change this out again, so. And you don't wanna break off anything on the inside. That's probably good. And just take your putty, clean it up. business one thing off the honeydew list well I hope it was a help uh, sometimes this can be a pain in the butt especially when that center breaks out knowing how to get it back out so guys have a good day